What is going on, people? Welcome to Fishing with Reed. I'm your host, Charles Reed, for another exciting, relaxing day right here in, uh, I believe we're at Lake Johnson tonight in the United States. Check where we're at. Yes, uh, Lake Johnson. So in episode two, we caught some decent fish. I believe I caught a some kind of swordfish. I think it was a swordfish. I'm not totally sure. So now in episode three, we're gonna try to catch some some big ones. Okay. So what uh what is some news for today at tonight's episode? Well, in good news, I have a new retail job. Yes, Charles Reed has a new retail job. It is at a grocery store and I will be doing uh stock late night stock that's normally what i prefer to do you know when i do work and um yeah it's gonna be great whoa what is up with my uh line here i think i'm stuck Yeah, I had a job before doing uh, fast food, and it, it did not work out. I did not like it at all. Fast food is just not for me. Um, but I did it, to, you know, I had to make money. But I found something else. Better opportunity. I mean, summer is coming up, you guys, so we're going to have to actually do some real-life fishing episodes right here on uh, Fishing with Reed. So stay tuned for that. I don't know when that's going to happen, but we plan on doing that. See somebody right there. See a big fish right there. Come on. Well, in other, uh, in other news, I know, uh, this, I don't know what it is, but every episode I feel like someone has passed away. I think in the first episode I mentioned my, uh, Grandpa Chris ended up passing away, unfortunately. And I said he was always a big fishing guy, and, uh, the, the, the next episode after that, I believe DMX, a uh, legendary rapper, he passed away. Now, this episode, I hate to say this, but my Grandpa John has passed away. And, uh, he was the one I was actually mo mostly closest to growing up as a kid. And, uh, once again, he was a big fishing guy, you know. he We used to always fish in the... up north, you know. And, uh, rest in peace, Grandpa John. We were gonna miss you, man. 
he was old. He was he was up there in age though. He was about 80 years old and he lived a long life. The funeral is tomorrow, so we're gonna say our final goodbyes. I mean, we've already said our final goodbyes when he was here, but. Sad. I hate mentioning that mentioning you know funerals every episode so far in fishing with Reed, but I mean it happens. I mean it, it's life. I'm just happy he lived a happy life, you know, and he, he lived a long life. It's not like you know some people like end up dying in their 40s and 50s nowadays. It's it's crazy from accidents or drugs, you know. No, he lived a long life and he was he was a religious guy. He was he was close with God, so sad times, you guys. But we're going to make this a happy episode because we're going to catch some good fish. I hope we do. Let's put this in troll mode. Funny, you can see my boat engine. If you guys want to pick up this game, this is a uh, fishing sim world, the Bass Pro Shops edition, or the Xbox One. There are other fishing sim world games, as I mentioned before, but you can't see underwater. I like the underwater camera on this one. I'll tell you what, this game was hard as hell. Hard as hell to find because I had to go all the way to a Bass Pro Shops store an hour away just to find this damn game because GameStop did not have it. Uh, Target didn't have it. Walmart didn't have it. I'm like, what? Maybe it was exclusive to the Bass Pro Shops and Cab Cabela stores. Not totally sure, but I couldn't find it anywhere. What a beautiful day. I'm telling you one thing, it's getting hot hot outside, you guys. 
I'm here in this weekend. It might be up to 80 degrees here in Michigan. 80 degrees, you guys. Maybe, no, actually, I think it's late 80s. Might be close to 90 I'm hearing. Summer is coming. I don't see any damn fish out here. All right, we're gonna reel this one in. On. Seems like a good spot. Any damn thing? What you doing? I think I'm stuck again. Oh, what happened? What the fuck? Oh, wait, what's going on? <laughs> what the fuck is going on? Where's my line? Okay. That was weird. Ah, oh, excuse me. So, in the last episode, well, I think I was vaping at the time. Yeah, I'm pretty much done with vaping, you guys. Uh, I don't know, I was looking more into it, and I'm thinking vaping can actually crystallize your lungs, I'm hearing, and people are having issues within the first five years of vaping. You could even be hospitalized. I've heard, and I don't know if it's all true, but I don't want to deal with all that, so I stopped vaping, but I did stop cigarettes. I'm still cigarette-free. There was one day I did pick up a pack of smokes, but I only smoked a couple, and I I, I think I threw them away after that. It was a waste of money. Um, but I'm now smoking cigars. I know cigars aren't the greatest either. I know they're not a safe alternative to cigarettes, but... I don't know, I mean, I feel like they're not as addicting as cigarettes, and there's less chemicals, so I don't know, I, I just, I gotta smoke something, you guys, because I am a smoker, I am, 
Can't help it. I like to smoke. Only God knows how I'll go, though, you know, in life. Hopefully I don't get cancer someday. I hope I don't, but... Maybe I'll end up quitting again. Who knows? I, I quit on and off. Shit. We might not catch anything this episode, you guys. I don't see jack shit so far. I feel like it's not really deep over here. Let's, let's get this fucker back in here. Come on. There we go. Now we wait. <sighs> so if you guys have been following the Video Game XD um, Facebook, Restore Thunder Episode 7 is coming, you guys. Wade has been, uh, we had some technical difficulties with Wade's, uh, computer, but he, he did this episode, and it is coming soon. It will be on YouTube, I'm guessing, within this week or next week. I know it took a while, it's been months, but, uh, like I said, we had some technical difficulties. It was a great episode, though. Can't wait. You guys see any fish? Cause I don't see jack shit. <laughs> oh, 
Oh wait. There's something over there. See something back there. You gotta remember too, in fishing, you don't always catch, you might not catch anything. There's been times where I went fishing in real life and I didn't catch, I didn't catch jack shit. I guess in other news, I have been doing uh, donating plasma, you guys. Me and my girlfriend needed some extra cash, and we decided to donate some plasma. So we donated some plasma. I mean, it's a little scary to have to stick a needle in you and take your plasma out, and you gotta sit there for like 40 minutes. But uh, they do, they do give you a, a decent chunk of money. I'll tell you that, and uh, you are helping people by donating. So. I don't plan on doing it all the time. So far, I've only did it three times. So I'm probably going to take a break from it right now, but it's a cool option if you need money. I mean, you might be broke and you want you know, money for bills or spending money. If you're a collector and you like to buy collectibles, such as myself, <laughs> donating plasma is an option. about Lake Johnson. So far this is a... Whoa! Here we go. I see something! I see you. You guys see that? See that big fella? I don't know, I saw a bass or something back there.
There's some. Oh, one of those swordfish things. Come on, where are you going? That's what we caught on uh, the last episode. Those things are fucking huge. Swam away. <laughs> yeah, that sucks. I don't know, you guys, this might be a bust. Bust of an episode, because I don't see... Sh I don't see nothing. I didn't even get a bite yet. Alright, we're gonna move the boat, maybe once more if we don't get nothing, it'll be the end of the episode because I don't see nothing today, you guys. Maybe it's just a bad spot, because I don't know. I've seen a few fish, like a bass, I've seen a, one of those swordfish things again, but that's about it.
Ain't nothing out here either. What the hell? There's like no fish in this lake. So did you guys see the new Mortal Kombat movie? I enjoyed it. Um, it wasn't like amazing. I still think the 1995 movie was the best. Can't top the 90s. Uh, Annihilation though was pretty bad. But I actually seen that in the theater when I was a kid, so whatever. I still liked Annihilation. Um, problem with the new one is just I felt like it was too fast. Like every it was like constant action, constant, like, you know, you're seeing Goro, and then you're seeing Raiden, and then you're seeing Shang Tsung, like, it was just like, bam, 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 like, one after another, it's like, felt like it was rushed, like, they didn't take their time in developing the characters, it was too quick. I mean, the violence was there, I mean, the, the fatalities, it was definitely that spot on, and as far as the characters, they looked, you know, very accurate to the video games, I was happy with that. But I just felt like, man, it was just, it's going by too quick. And I felt like by the end of the movie, I wanted more. Like, by the, by the time it was over, I'm like, really? That's it? And I guess the next one, they're going to introduce Johnny Cage, you know? So, I'm happy, though, Mortal Kombat is back. It's still alive. It, it, Mortal Kombat could have been dead after the 90s, but they decided to continue it. And that's great, because I, I'm pretty big, uh... Mortal Kombat fan. I even have the damn fucking dragon tattooed on me for God's sakes. I just always thought it was a fun movie series and a game series, of course. I started with the games for. I actually started with the original on Super Nintendo and Sega, and then and then I moved up to Mortal Kombat two, then three, then four. I started with the very original, and then I worked my way up to, you know, till now. And I was literally, I've literally been playing it since I was uh, probably five or six years old. So, of course, the Super Nintendo one didn't wasn't bloody and had had fatalities, but I didn't I didn't care. I thought it was still awesome. So I seen another fucking swordfish thing, but it fucking swam away. Going on 35 minutes, you guys, and we haven't catched a damn thing. <laughs> Not even a bite.
I don't know, you guys. I don't think we're going to catch anything this episode. But hey, it was still fun hanging out. <laughs> See, that's what Fishing with Three is all about. It's not about just catching fish. It's about uh, hanging out, you know, talking about things, and talking about life, and updates with things. You know, just because you don't catch anything doesn't mean it, it's, you know, it's like fishing in real life. You're not always going to catch anything, you know, but it's a, it's a hobby, you know, there's always next time. All right. Well, this was Fishing with Reed, episode 3. Hope you guys enjoyed uh, the video. Subscribe right here to Video Game XD. We're on Facebook, we're on YouTube, Twitch. We're, we're even on Discord now. I haven't advertised a lot, but Video Game XD is on Discord. So check that out. Um, yeah. I will see you guys on episode 4. Not sure when it's coming, but it is. Uh, this has been an episode of Fishing with Reed. See you guys next time.